How y'all doing? Yeah, I, I've had a little heel time and uh, I'm feeling a little better and uh, so I'm gonna get back to work. Stuff's piling up, dude. It just I'm laying here trying to sleep and they're just adding on, adding on, adding on. I'm like, dude, we gotta get back at this. I ain't gonna be able to remember all this shit, dude. Come on now. So uh, yeah, we negotiated and uh, I'm back. So, but I, 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 I'm on probation. So if I have to lay back down, I'll have to do that. But for right now, I'm good to go. So one of the coolest things, well, one of the things that, uh, the entire story won't come till after I get my super brain, but it's more about that Baptist. Turns out, uh, that third Baptist after John. He is uh, one of God's uh, favoritest people. He uh, he was put in a hard spot, and uh, he was forced to uh, give up his life, or else give up the line of Christ. And uh, he sacrificed himself for her. And on top of it, she didn't know that she was the line of Christ. And so from that point on, only one person knew who the line of Christ was all about. The Father and Jesus. And uh, it was a secret from then on. But it was all because of the sacrifice of the third Baptist. He loves those threes. I don't know how that worked out, but uh, that's what happened. And uh, I guess there's more to that story, but I, I won't be able to tell you all that until I get the uh, super brain. Because uh, I'm going to be able to do a lot more on that side, is what he's telling me. As we were laying here talking, um, I'll, I'll be able to uh, uh, communicate a lot better on that side. And, and see things that uh, I haven't been able to see now. Because he's been saying my rabbit ears aren't all that good. Well, they probably aren't because I don't have the super brain rabbit ears. So, but I'm gonna be getting them. Okay, back to work. Course correction. There's this guy that uh, he's uh, he's kind of important in my life. He he's he was before God to me and uh, made me realize who I am. I don't know if y'all ever heard of him, Jeff Foxworthy. Um, he uh, he came out with a list of uh, things that, uh, boy, I just like, wow, dude, I, every one of those damn things, I, I am that. I, yeah, that's me. Yeah, I've done that. Yeah, I've done that a couple times. Oh, I've definitely been involved in that before. <laughs> <laughs> and by the end of the show, I'm like, dude, that, yeah. You were like talking into my soul. Oh man. And I I I got a course correction for you though, buddy. And I'm sorry about this, but I someone's gotta bring it up to you. I don't know if you knew it or not. But I watched that entire show and at the end of the show I went through all the credits. I did not find one place where I could get that damn sign. Is it it was dot com? Uh is there an eight hundred number? Um Old school P.O. Box? Dude, how could you make an awesome club like that and, and then not tell us how the hell to get the sign? Dude, you can, you're handing it out the whole damn show, but never once did you tell us where we could get it. Dude, I want that sign. Oh. And then I watched other shows trying to... Still, nothing. The elusive sign. Did you not think that through, buddy? I really wondered that because... Dude, you start this awesome club, you give a checklist, and if, if you if you meet the requirements, dude, you are one of us. Here's your sign. Where's my damn sign? How in the hell do I get my sign? That's all I'm asking. That's all right. You know what? I, I, hopefully I'll get to meet you and you can get me one, would you? Because uh, I did. I went through the credits twice sometimes. I did not see an 800 number. I did not see anything. I did not know how the hell to get one of my signs. Because I'm telling you, dude, I am 100% one of you boys, okay? 
As a matter of fact, the other guys, Larry, cable guy, uh, Tim Allen, uh, you know, dude, you and me and Tool Man, oh man, that I love that show. You know, all you guys, it, it, I, I hate to tell you, but you kind of make the defense of the weaker sex. <laughs> Oh, a little more prevalent than ever, but <coughs> it's all called, it's all good because you know what? We're gonna get smarter now. We're we're gonna get smarter, and uh, we won't be the weaker sex anymore. Um, but you guys brought it out the best of all best. I mean, gosh, you guys. And I know there's more of you, but I just can't get it all in my head. I, you know, I'm still working on really limited rabbit ears. But uh, I uh, I just want to know about that course correction. I, I was to see if you might have given that any thought, dude. How now do I get my sign? That's all I want to know. Uh, P.O. Box. Maybe you work a deal out with the box tops, you know. Get the cereal companies involved. We give them so many box tops, and you'd be like, "Yeah, dude, they 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 love they love me. Let's make them a sign, and and you know, we'll give them box tops." And, and the cereal company like, "Nah, I don't know about that." Well, yeah, dude, we work it out. There's a lot of ways we can market this for uh, for us. You know, us rednecks, we need to get our sign. Anyway, just something to kick around. Course correction. Anyway, I'll get back at you.